Oh hi, thanks for watching my video. So today we are going to be doing something a little bit different. I was kind of hesitant to do something like this because I didn't know how well it would work with clothes and custom content, but we're gonna give it a go. So today we're gonna play The Sims as if it's still the 90s for no other reason than giving myself a good old nostalgia kick. So, I will introduce you to the family we are playing with. This is going to be the main star of the show here. This is Poppy. She's a teenager. She lives with her dad, Albert, and her mum, Caroline. They live in a pretty, pretty small house. It's probably more of a British-looking uh, 90s house than anything else. So, we're going to be joining Poppy for a day. And today is a big day because she's got a big sleepover planned. But it's still pretty early in the morning. They've just moved in. So she's got the day off school today. So I guess we'll just do some dicking around. It looks like they're just watching a bit of TV for the time being. What are you watching, guys? You watching some Rugrats or something? Well, we do have quite a few hours to kill before we meet up with the girls. So maybe we'll just go and chill in our room. Can you tell which room is the teenager's room by any chance? I decided to go with the girly 90s rather than the uh, punky kind of 90s vibe. Why don't we go talk to some friends? Log into our messenger. We need to come up with some new song lyrics for our name anyway. I'm thinking Spice Girls. You should make our name, uh, if you want to be my lover, you've got to get with my friends. Seems like quite a current name, don't you think? Oh, one thing I found when I was looking for custom content that I was really impressed with and just took me right back was uh, some custom content I found from around The Sims. Bratz dolls, the actual Bratz dolls. Jade was my favorite. Genuinely, really impressed with that. I was so happy. And uh, a lot of this is from around The Sims, actually. The Polly Pocket, the Furbies, and the um, My Little Ponies are all from around The Sims. Just in case you wondered. Oh shit, mum's coming. Maybe she's trying to have the talk with us. Wait, is she flirting? Why are you talking to your child seductively, you fucking creep? Mum, try and talk to my friends on MSN Messenger, okay? I don't need some advice on how to use a tampon. I'm all good. Don't worry about it. Need to think of some ideas of what we can do with the girls tonight when we have our sleepover. Maybe we can use our home phone to call up some boys. That would be fun. Genuinely what I used to do at sleepovers with my friends. Oh, sweet game. What are you playing? Tekken 2? Tekken 2 was the best one. Michelle Chang, all the way. Maybe we should take a break from this at some point and play Sonic the Hedgehog. Or Rayman, even better. Oh, you can um, ask Furby for a joke. Looks like he's making a joke about divorce. <laughs> classic. That's a classic one, Furby. Oh, he just dissed us. Totally slated to the ground. I is she now sad? Smart speaker sadness, why doesn't it listen to me? It's just a smart speaker, surely I'm the smarter one. Right, I think, are you really going to go into your parents' bed just to cry? Just because your Furby doesn't like you? Oh, 90s problems, am I right? Right, come on, let's go meet the girls at the arcade. That'll be fun. Let me introduce you to my friends. This is Marley. We've been friends since we were kids. Say hello, Marley. And this is Taylor. She was one of the cool kids at school, but then we became her friend too. <gasps> dance, dance revolution! <laughs> I thought maybe it would be treated as like a piece of decor that you could view, but actually <laughs> it looks like it's taken the place of like a gravestone. <laughs> I really wish we had a dance dance revolution that we could actually play with. But for now, I guess it'll just have to be there for aesthetic purposes. Why don't we play Pac-Man together? Oh, well, I really hope we meet some boys here. The boys will think we're so cool because we're playing games. Just ignore the fact that um, Taylor just got out a smartphone to take a picture. God damn it, Sims 4. You ruin everything. Although, you know what? The game itself does look pretty 90s, doesn't it? I wonder what the other game looks like. Oh, I see. So it's pretty much the same game, just with a slightly different skin. So we don't have Pac-Man? All right, girls. Now it's time for a sleepover tradition. We gotta make up a dance. We need to rehearse so we get it perfect for our Backstreet's back rehearsal at the school talent show. I want to go home with the trophy at least. Just notice she does have Furby as like an acquaintance in her group of friends. So what do you guys want to do after this? I'm thinking maybe we head to Blockbuster, 
rent a video, um, watch a movie, and then maybe we'll just play some games at our house. What do you think? All right, well, I'll let you finish this game and figure out who wins, and then we're going to go to Blockbuster and pick a movie to watch, okay? Who's this creep coming in, staring at us? Such a shame we didn't get to play Dance Dance Revolution. If anyone watching this uh, makes mods, I would be so happy if you made an interactive Dance Dance Revolution map. <laughs> I'm sure it's probably a lot of hard work. The way she's talking, I kind of feel like I'm watching a TV show and she's presenting it. Like she's talking to me, the audience, whilst watching such a riveting game. That's how I feel right now. Right guys, seriously, right, I'm ending this game now. We gotta go because if we stay here any much longer, we're gonna miss Top of the Pops. Come on, we gotta get the bus. We gotta go Blockbuster. All right, here we are. It's time to pick our favorite movie. Looks like there'll be lots of options for us. Oh, Lord of the Rings. Oh, that one hasn't come out yet. <laughs> What else hasn't come out yet? Harry Potter's not come out yet. Pirates of the Caribbean has not come out yet. <laughs> right, girls, what do you think? We could watch that new movie, Jawbreaker, that's just come out of the cinema. Or maybe we could go old school, watch Clueless. I'm really easygoing. I don't mind. Whatever you guys want. We could just watch something by Mary-Kate Nashley. We'll pick up some snacks. Get ourselves a nice cold soda. Gonna get myself a Fruity Fanta. Fruity Fanta twist. I don't know about you guys. That's what I'm, that's my beverage of choice for tonight. You know what I think would sell really well? And there might already be something like this out there, I've never really looked. But I reckon, if someone released like a simulation game that was set in the 90s, I genuinely think it would sell really well. And I think these guys agree with me, they've been discussing it. Why you guys, oh, it's love day, that's why they're singing and celebrating. Oh, they have like a whole screening room back here. Oh, that's a bit too futuristic for us, so we're going to head home. Okay, I'm going to form a group with the girls just so that they all do stuff together. There we go. Let's watch some TV. Mum, get in that kitchen and bring us some snacks. We love watching TV. I wonder if Ross and Rachel will ever get together. Well, this is nice. Casual girls night in. I do wish there was a way for me to disable their use of mobile phones, though. It does somewhat break the, uh, the immersion. So guys, you still playing with those Tamagotchis? Yeah, I'm not allowed to buy them anymore. My mum said she was sick of always having to take it into work to take care of it since they got banned at school. Yeah, sucks, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, the parents were just playing a game of Cluedo together. That's cute. Well done for keeping yourselves out of the way. Should we have some dinner then? All right, this is enough hanging around. Let's go... Let's go to our room and just hang out in there. I do have this game of Hungry Hungry Hippos, but I don't think it works. Because the option comes up to just play cards. So I don't know whether that means they're going to sit down and just get some cards out or what the deal is with that. I might move it more to the middle of the room. <laughs> so they can kind of interact with it. All it does is it just gets them to play cards. And it works if you don't have a table underneath, so it's just kind of floating in midair. Okay, guys, winner of this game gets to go first on Dream Phone. What is it with these parents and constantly cramping our style? Go to bed. Get out of here. It's like half twelve in the morning. <laughs> we have spent all night watching Friends, playing cards. We should probably go to bed at some point. There's only one bed, and today is the day they've decided they're not going to scooch. I never know where I am with my sims. Sometimes they get in the bed and they scooch over, and then other times they, they just don't. So I guess I'll just get you guys some beds. I really try to find um, bubble furniture. You know, like inflatable air beds or something. Or even like sleeping bags, but I couldn't find anything. Alright, lights out. So get in bed. I don't care if you guys... Stay up and gossip. Guys, come on, it really isn't that hard. Just lay in bed. Why is the dad coming in? So invasive. Go to bed. Coming into a sleepover at 2 a.m. Creep. Poppy, your dad's a creep. Right, okay, you guys, you can just go to bed. I was going to have you relax a little bit, chat a little bit, but you guys can't even handle that. So forget it, you ruined it, let's just go to bed. Making this video has genuinely made me feel pretty nostalgic. 
I love the 90s. I did also really want to do a uh, living in the 80s video. And it might still be on the cards for something in the future, but as it stands at the moment, I just... For videos like this, you have to rely pretty heavily on custom content, and I couldn't really see a lot of custom content that was specifically for the 80s. There were a few bits that I could use to furnish a house, but... If you'd like to see a video of Sims living in the 80s, then leave me some suggestions in the comments below of what kind of activities you would do in the 80s. I mean, I guess there is arcade, maybe disco dance. But other than that, I couldn't, couldn't really think of anything. But on that note, I think I'm going to end this video here. So I will. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe. You know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video, where we'll be back in 2022. Bye-bye.